हाई एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल अंकिता एडमायरर्स दिस इज़ द डे फोर ऑफ द ओम चैंटिंग मेडिटेशन एंड आई एम रियली सॉरी गाइज आई कुडेंट मेक इट यस्टरडे बिकॉज वन ऑफ माई फ्रेंड मेट अ स्मॉल एक्सीडेंट एंड आई हैड टू गो टू विजिट हर टू सी इफ शी इज डूइंग फाइन और नॉट and thankfully with the blessing of god she is doing fine now so i really missed my om chanting yesterday and i was thinking because i uh, see sometimes what we plan we can't implement it right so i planned it for 7 days and i did, like i didn't want any kind of a uh, gap in between but this happened that's all right it must happen for a reason so again we are going to do the om chant and we'll do the same things as we discussed on day 3 um on day 3 there was there was one tragedy happened and uh, my eyes are very swollen today for no reason i don't know if this happened with me in the winter time so ignore it ओके सो वॉट आई वॉज या सो वी विल लाइक वी विल इम्प्लीमेंट वॉट वी डिड ऑन डे थ्री मीन्स वी विल डू इट विद अर्ध पदमासना एंड ऑल्सो विल कीप आई विल कीप माई हैंड्स लाइक दिस यू कैन कीप योर हैंड्स इन द हैंड मुद्रा इफ यू वॉन्ट अ क्लोज अ लॉक लाइक दिस लाइक okay i will do it like this and uh, we'll do the om chant we'll see how the experience goes for today till now if i talk about my om chanting experience one thing i want to share with you if i like i couldn't do it yesterday and i was missing it i was missing the vibration of hmm in the body okay that humming sound is so relaxing like no music no frequency music can make you feel like that not no but most of the frequency music can't make you feel like that because see this is what you are doing as an exercise okay one thing that i will do a uh, different today is i will focus on this part right keep will keep my face relaxed and uh, also what else is i will focus on my breath and uh, on this part or this part right so what happens uh, like uh, when you start your meditation uh, this is the third uh, focus point of uh, you know in in your breathing meditation so um, initially you focus on breathe in breathe out then uh, you focus on um, maybe uh, some other how what is the warmth of your breath breath or uh, you know on this part but i will either i will see if i can focus on this part or this part but i will not get distracted into the thoughts like if i uh, compare from day 1 to day 3 on day 3 i was getting less uh, you know distracted by the thoughts rather than or as compared to day 1 so i think it's working really well for my overthinking part i can sleep so well i can sleep like a baby right now okay um if i want uh, what happened like uh, after the 3 days of om chanting meditation is i don't want to use my phone okay i don't want to use my phone rather i would choose to sleep and the way i sleep oh my god it's <laughs> it's so good i like i get very sound sleep when i like when i wake up i it's very much you know i feel very much energetic so keeping my spine straight and like for the time being at at least fixing the microphone of this earphone 
so uh, if if you are seeing this pillow i have it because the wall is so cool and it's winter time and uh, when i do the om chant my cuff uh, get increased and uh, that's why i i sneeze in between <coughs> and also my sinus gets activated for some reason after the om chanting it gets back to normal so let's start with it breathing in holding the breath this will help us to detach i'm breathing out through mouth i will do it for 3 times breathing in holding my breath and breathing out through mouth after breathing out hold the breath again breathe in hold the breath for at least 4 5 seconds and breathe out i in the name of power god divine detach myself from this world and this body and this mind i connect myself as a soul with the divine power and invite it to connect with me to help me in my meditation journey I believe the three god Shiva Brahma Vishnu are present in a o m hmm. I call upon them to spread the bliss on all the people watching this video doing the om chanting or just listening this video
I got sweat in my hands. All right, guys. So we have completed a day four of Om chanting, and I can imagine if someone do this for six months or a year. they can change their life you know 360 degree they can change their life 360 degree this is such a bliss i am still feeling the vibration in my body I opened my eyes and I felt something going up and then I again means I didn't force myself I do not force myself while doing doing the meditation but when I opened my eyes I realized I am not able to speak to recognize where I am and I even forget how my house looks like i don't know if you can believe or not if you if you can't believe then do it for 4 days okay if you can't believe then do it for 4 days you will get to know what is it one special thing that i realized today was the hmm sound it is really good like the puffiness of my eyes is gone completely you can go back to the uh, video the start of the video you can see my eyes then and you can see my eyes now can you see it like here okay the camera is here so uh the refreshment i am feeling right now the uh, you know the the shine of like the the shine of uh, my soul i am feeling right now is incredible and trust me because i am full of positive energy right now i pray to divine to power or whatever the name is in the name of this divinity i wish that your wish come to fulfillment right now your wish come to fulfillment right now may you get each blessing each blessing in the second of you know the blinking of an eyelid okay the blink in one blink you uh, your wishes come true in a second in the in a one tenth part of a second your blessings come true your wishes come true you you are fulfilled you are abundant you are extremely happy and blessed and spiritual and relaxed and peaceful and this came straight from my heart <laughs> mujhe apne sharir mein 50 gram bhi wazan feel nahi ho raha is time apna i am not even feeling like i am of half a kg 
I'm feeling this this much light. Seriously, do not. Uh, there was a time when I, you know, what can I say? When I doubted all this. I used to ask my sister, um, do you really think Shiva exists? Do you really think Vishnu exists? Do you really think uh, there is something like law of attraction? Or do you really think uh, if subliminals work? Or uh, like what is the uh, truth behind writing the affirmations? Okay. But what I realized today is to believe. Believe in what? See, we call it divine. We call it power. I don't know if the actual name is divine or power, but there is something that is supreme. Okay. And I devote myself to that thing. There is something very much supreme. I devote myself to that and I pray to that to make you happy, to uh, get you everything that you want, that you need, that you desire and that you, that is good for you. Okay, that is good for you, for your entire life. If I talk about the Om chanting specifically, it's just the day four. I haven't even completed day seven yet and the results are amazing like spe specially for specifically for the overthinking depression stress if you use your phone a lot and when you when you just close your phone or when you get it charged you get a lot of bad thoughts do the own chanting it will help you if you if you can't control yourself like uh, just by, um, like just by scrolling the phone or you spend your time scrolling the phone or you can't decide what's happening in life you are frustrated or maybe you're not happy with your life do the own chanting if you can't sleep if you or if even if you sleep for eight nine good hours and or maybe six hours but you feel lethargic whole day do the om chanting if you um feel drained very early if you can't focus in work if something doesn't uh, you know make you happy in the daytime like you can't con you can't enjoy working or your office work or your study specifically for student so if you are a parent there is one thing that i want to add on if you are a parent of a, a five year old or a, a toddler or a, even a small baby okay or a 10 year old or eight whatever the age your kid has if they can speak make them do the om chanting once a day you can choose the day according to your convenience i do it each day uh, like between 7 to 8 a pm sorry in the evening time and then i post it in the night time so it, because it takes one and one half hour to uh, get post because the video is so long and uh, this is the best thing you can make your child learn if there is someone in your family who is uh, suffering from the brain hemorrhage okay keep your medication on keep everything on but ask them to do the om chanting for at least three hours a day i know this is a lot of time okay but why i am saying the three hours because i usually do it for like 45 minutes each day and it gives a lot of benefit but uh, in the uh, cases like uh, stress or depression or uh, you know the 
frustration or this brain hemorrhage or maybe any kind of mental issues or um, you know if uh, if your child is suffering from any kind of issues like uh, if their finger or any part of the body is not working properly you can make them it's not uh, like it um, the three hours time that i told you is dependent on how you are suffer suffering from something okay so if it's a normal uh, like issue in your life or a temporary issue or the issue is not big or you don't have time do it for 10 minutes do it for 10 minutes but the main thing is do it do it with consistency do it with consistency do not miss it do not you know um, do not miss it do not underestimate it okay so this was it uh, if I summarize the main thing that I uh, you know the main uh, experience I did today was the upper part of the body and when I was chanting the humming sound hmm, it really just it was uh, feeling like a facial massage or a head massage together even my uh, hair bent uh, was like I felt a very stunned kind of uh, with this today so and another thing uh, that a uh, second thing that I experienced was I felt very light I am feeling very light and the third thing that I am uh, like focusing uh, or uh, sorry experiencing today is while I am speaking no it coming very fluently I don't need to stress it out it's very fluent and I can sit silent without anything for hours from now this is the state of mind I have right now so that's it video ek ghante ka ho gaya hai isse zyada main bolna nahi chahungi agar aapko mera video pasand aaya hai please do give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel so that you get notified whenever i upload a new video and uh, share it with the one who needs it if someone is drinking a lot if someone is having a stressful job if someone is getting stressed for finding a job share it with them maybe your one share can change their life maybe right uh, that's it and please do comment on the video first do the meditation first do the om chant and then comment how you felt i would love to read it and reply you and anything negative bad you think it, it's in my video you can like you can say anything just putting your heart out no matter if it's bad or good uh, it's okay or it's all right i'm there to spread bliss no matter what okay we met for a reason and uh, i hope we can go further and i know this is a long journey so we are going on this path together and uh, i hope we will build good relations here so that's it for now take care be blissful be happy sleep well and uh, meditate meditate a lot okay bye bye take care have fun have compassion